Hey everyone, my name's Chris, and today I'm reviewing laser tape. What is it? It's a tape measure with a laser. Now don't get too excited because it's not a laser that can do anything really fun. All it can do is measure. But if you want to measure something that's far away, maybe it would be helpful. I'd never heard of a laser tape until Uptech Instruments said they wanted to send me one to review. So let's do a review of a tape measure with a laser. All right, this laser tape measure comes with two AAA batteries and a little screwdriver. The screwdriver is important because that's the only way to get the battery compartment open, which I find a little annoying and unnecessary. At least the screw stays in the compartment door so you don't lose it. Unfortunately, you can't get rid of the screw because that's the only thing that keeps the door closed. Okay, before we get onto the laser, let's talk about the tape measure. It's the first tape measure I've seen that has markings on both sides of the tape, and I could see that being really handy. I did a how far can you pull out the tape before it snaps test, and it reached just about six feet, which is okay, but it's not setting any records. In comparison, my other tape measure can go eight feet before it snaps. The tape has two small but relatively strong magnets on the tab thingy at the end, which could be handy if you need to measure how far your drums are away from the window. Of course, if your window is too far, the magnets might not be strong enough to hold, in which case you might want to warm up the laser. Aim the laser at the drums, press the button, and boom, now you know how far it is from your drum to your window. 3.929 meters. The laser is pretty easy to work. One press on the red button to power up, press it another time to turn the laser on, aim the laser at what you want to measure, and press the button a third time to get the measurement. Note that you can control if the measurement is calculated from the front of the tape measure or the back. However, make sure to choose the option before you make the measurement, because nothing changes if you try and do it after. What does change though is the units. If you measured something in meters and want to know what it is in feet, you can find out really easy. A long press on the unit button will cycle through the six different options for how your measurement is shown. The laser worked great for measuring distances inside my house, but outside on a bright sunny day, it was almost impossible to tell where the laser was pointing. So I just aimed it vaguely at my garage door and kept moving farther and farther away. Apparently there's a fence 29.296 meters away from our garage door. That was about as far as I could get though. Anything else I aimed at that was farther away, I just kept getting error one message. I tried it again at night to see if that made any difference. I could definitely see the laser better, but I still wasn't able to get a measurement much more than 30 meters. Meters. Error. I also did a test for consistency, one in a Lego drawer, and it consistently gave me the same reading. I also did the test on a longer distance, which had about a 1mm variation over the multiple times I tried it. I did notice that the measurement of the laser was consistently a couple millimeters shorter than the measurement of the tape. However, that was easy to fix because the laser can be calibrated up to plus or minus 9mm. So I added a couple millimeters, and boom. Synchronicity. All right, so this is the end of the review where I sum everything up in a concise way. Is the laser tape good? Yeah. It'll definitely have its place in my tape measure pile. I have that many tape measures because I'm always losing them. So generally by the time I've lost the last one, I'm finding the first one. The tape measure itself is a tape measure. It's kind of nice because it has the markings on the bottom. The laser works well. I wasn't able to get the 60 meters of range that it claims it has. I was generally hitting about 30 and then not much past that. However, if you're needing to measure more than 30 meters, I don't know who you are. One thing I kind of would like to see is maybe a cover for the laser lens. I'm assuming that if that gets scratched, it might not work properly. And if I'm just throwing this in my box with my tools, it's going to get scratched. So something to think about. Other than that, yeah, fun measuring. Who knew? Thanks for watching. See ya. Measuring tape. <laughs>